because it, we have anxiety now as an instinct based on, on, on human nature. And that's what it is. Anxiety is like you need to be alert, protect. If, if you if, have it all the time, it's a, it becomes a problem. If it happens all the time, there's a pretty good chance something is making it happen. Every situation is different. can be the person or the situation or something like this, but the self-awareness per se makes you help and deal with it or cope with it better because you will be like able to like literally like step to the side and be like, wait a minute, this was my trigger. This is reminding me of, of, of what, what happened and my reaction, my anxiety is completely normal. And instead of, of fighting that feeling that comes up, which is normal and natural, would be, that would be kind of wrong to say that it shouldn't be there. It should also be there. You will actually allow it to like anxiety. That's okay. Because this was a traumatic event. This was something that bad happened and allow it. And you, you can, you can literally learn to hold and be like there and okay, it's, a, it's all right. Because what most people do who have not had the grounding techniques or the scare feds or something, which is also normal, but they, they try to side and suppress the feeling. And that makes an anxiety or a panic much worse. Yes, you make it less of a challenge. You have to see it like like a pot with boiling water. If you put the lid on it and you keep repressing it down, eventually the, the, the steam and everything wants to come out. But if you will eventually, if you have to do this for literally years, let's say, you will be so weak, your arm cannot take it.